see if we get these guys out of here. Alright, do that. I need energy. Alright, let's book it a little bit. You talking about I don't got enough energy. Dodge percent. Uh, all right. If I dodge him, I do a lot of damage. Okay. And he's bleeding out, which is good. Which means I think I won this time. Yep, I won this time. I don't know what I pulled off his body, but I think it'd be worth it. Let's go around and collect everything else that I forgot to grab. Oh, coins. No, this door opens onto the square, not exactly at the street exit. Uh, as I was gonna say, don't, I don't think it's discreet matters right now. You just killed three gold cloaks. I mean, they are in, they are dead in this house, so they'll probably just chalk it up to somebody got in. Do 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 do. You guys see nothing. I was not here. Actually, I'm heading towards a whorehouse, aren't I? So. Uh. I think this is where I wanted to go. Chitayas. I thought it was at Chitayas. Oh well. Now he is a visitor who brings back pleasant memories. Is that really you, Sir Alistair? It has been a long time, Chitayas. Oh my. She might know where the hell he is. Yes, we'll see what happens. Uh, corridor to the... nope.
Nope, that's not it. Varys. Secret Master of Secrets. He fought in the rebellion as well. Excuse my rudeness. I have not yet told you my name. I am Lord Varys. Did everybody fight on Robert's side? As a friend. We never crossed paths 15 years ago, but perhaps you have heard of me? Lord Varys. Oh yes, I know you. You were master of whispers to old King Eris Targaryen. I did not recognize you. Disguised as you are, I remember a more elegant man of the court. Well, I am delighted to hear that. Let us simply say that I sometimes prefer to go unnoticed. You haven't changed. Already in the time of Eris, it was said that you had eyes in every court in Westeros, and that you knew everything about everyone. That's what he specializes in. Some of our lords were wary of you. You made some enemies along the way. Alas, the people of the Seven Kingdoms have little affection for eunuchs. All of the noble knights and grand lords are loath to risk their reputations with informers and spies. But in the Game of Thrones, information is power. Those who most despise us are often the first to benefit from our whispers. Please pardon my curiosity. <laughs> frequenting houses of ill repute. Well, there are a thousand little nothings to be learned in this sort of establishment. All great men are talkative, you understand. And True. And King Robert was kind enough to keep me in my position. I have much to do here. It would really surprise me if our meeting were purely chance. Indeed, but my intentions are good. I wanted to discuss the Baratheon Rebellion. Why not? There is one question that I have never been able to be free of. Do you believe that the Rebellion was a good thing? After all, it's Probably. Good. Is King Baratheon a better king than Targaryen? Oh, He's not lighting his team on... Mad, my lord. Mad and cruel. That Doesn't say. Baratheon's not lighting people on fire. His subjects love him. Of that I have little doubt. But he pays little heed to matters of the realm and remains blind to the enemies around him. I fear that a new rebellion brews on the horizon. Does that knowledge make you regret your part in the rebellion? Some good came of it all the same. I find comfort in telling myself that all was not done in vain. You would Oh, were, were we fighting under Tywin? He dragged you into that war yeah. and carried out your duty as a bannerman. At the time, Lord Tywin wanted a foot in each camp. When he ordered us to fight for Robert, I chose to follow his orders. Yes. Bitterness, you fought valiantly. And more importantly, you were on the winning side. That usually helps. Time came to reap the benefits of your efforts. You turned away and left Westeros. I admit that I do not understand why. It is something that I recall without fondness, Lord Harry. I don't even know why he left. Ah, my dear Alistair, it is too cruel of you to leave my curiosity thus unsatisfied. But your secrets. I just realized I spent like 10 minutes talking to this dude. did not spur me on us as you did. Lord Tywin Lannister covered him in gold and invited him to reward him for his exploits and his unfailing For 
For his unspeakable brutality, you mean to say. I had the opportunity to behold his work again in the square. Such a wild beast should not be left to roam free. He's like Much the mountain. He's just it is an invitation to just the left to do his thing. Savala has become an important member of the court. He is a faithful supporter of Queen Cersei's. So Cersei's in charge right now, okay. Do great harm if you were to make him an enemy. I strongly recommend that you avoid making such remarks in public. I watched him grow in both size and ferociousness. I know what he is capable of better than anyone. No need to worry though. I won't go provoking him without cause. He is a monster of a man. No, I'm afraid that I must beg your leave. Please excuse me. I'm afraid that my little birds are always chirping and demanding my attention. Make the most of your stay with Chatia. I hope to see you again soon. You probably will. I mean, I do have to go up to the court at some point. After I find Gwen's head and cut it off. Not Gwen, Gowen said. You are Helena, if I'm not mistaken. Shataya said that I might find you here. You are not mistaken, my lord. How might I please you? A one on one will be enough to satisfy me. Preferably far from prying ears. My lord needs only close the door. At Shataya's, the walls are thick and the beds are deep. Slow down. I just want to speak with you. Oh, oh my. In that case, it will be done according to my lord's pleasure. I am Alistair of House Sarwen. I imagine that means something to you. It's just... By the maiden, you are from Garwin's family, are you not? Did he send you? How is he? When will he return? By the Lord's flame. Why are you so concerned with my brother's fate? My lord, I know the realities of my profession. <laughs> but Taya treats us well, but in a few years I will be too old to draw men's eyes. And what awaits me then? Begging or walking the docks? I wish for Lord Garwin to take Oh my god, that's that's creepy as fuck. I'm not that naive. But he Jesus Christ. He will make a good master. He and I have talked about this. I understand your worry. They need to control their cameras. Do not tell me where he is. You recently sent him a love letter. You seem to be aware of his movements. Yes, my lord. Lord Garwin told me he was going to Riverspring in order to visit his father. Lambert, his servant, would send me news. He told me that Lord Garwin planned to return to King's Landing shortly. So that he wouldn't forget to pay me a visit, I sent him a message. He came here? Yes. But my message was for naught. He came directly here soon after his arrival in town. He found out that the city watch was looking for him. It was I who washed the dust of travel from him. He did not even go to his home first. At least he made it to King's Landing. I was beginning to wonder if he had disappeared along the way. So he's actually here in the city. He was very nervous. He hardly spoke to me that night. I tried to ask him questions about the patricide rumors, but they only made him angry. The last thing he said was that he would go to the Red Keep, that the Crown would hear what he had to say, and that he had more than one card to play. He left at the first line. Oh my. I have had no news since, and the Gold Coast continue to search for him. I guess we're going to the Red Keep. What do you plan to do, my lord? The City Watch has searched for him in vain for days. Even Lord Varys does not know his whereabouts, and Lord Varys knows all. If my brother went to the Red Keep, then that is where I must go. Someone must have seen him and will help me locate him. Wait. This cloak belongs to Lord Garwin. He forgot it. Take it, please. Fire. Fire. That's Sarwick guilt watches. I remember seeing Father wear it on many a special occasion. Indeed. A cloak is more appropriate for a royal interview. I wasn't expecting to find it in this place. Lord Garwin Hey guys, hope you're enjoying your stay. Follow me on Twitch to watch me finish these games out live. If you want to see more content like this, like, comment, subscribe, and it'll be up daily. Thank you for watching, and I will see you all next time.